Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the next episode of the Rag the Riches series. Let's quickly hide in a bush so I can show you this weapon real quick. And then we gotta get moving. We are rocking a AKM with a decent amount of attachments, so the, it should be okay. I forgot to put in a few items, but should work nonetheless. We need to get 15 kills for part one of Punisher. So that should be fun. We also need to get three of the of the tanks all marked up we uh what else we gotta do and we also gotta mark the different locations on the map for I forget what the name of the task is but yeah we have three markings as well we gotta do for that too so a lot of running around a lot of things to go to accomplish and hopefully get some loot along the way are you ready all right let's get moving let's get moving i got, I got a lot of things done here and i want to get moving fast because i don't want to get Stuck in this little area here where there's a bunch of players typically West 306 shouldn't be oh gosh too difficult unless I get shot in the face like I just did And survive it. Thank goodness Maybe I'll be switching directions and coming back to that tank I think I'm gonna have to do that because I I kind of heard the direction where I got shot, but Let's not risk it. Go. Hilt the head a little bit. Thank you, helmet. We're also bringing in PP rounds. Oh god. Move. We're bringing in PP rounds. Hopefully, we do pretty decent with them. Oh god. Really hate this. I really hate this. Oh my god. Oh my god. kill you whoever you are and it will be satisfying Oh god. A three man. I really need to get inside and fix up my stuff. Boys, I ain't got to make it far. Get in the basement here and fill up all our stuff. And then I got to hopefully find food, which we are technically in a good spot to find food. But we shall see what happens. The, there it is. It's like, where's it downstairs? It's around here somewhere.
Plus, I didn't bring a lot of painkillers with me, sadly. Put stomach first so I can stop losing energy and water. The other guy pushed off to the right somewhere. I have no idea where he went. Definitely was not expecting a three-man, though. Get legs. Oh, I could not kill him. Dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it. That was so expensive to build that gun, too. Mainly just the ammo. God, I couldn't kill him. Two of his friends are dead, though. I mean, that may have been something way different. Oh, that sucks. Man, what unfortunate luck I had. That, that was really unfortunate. All right, let's go. Let's get going. See what we can make happen here. At least we got two of the kills. And they were pretty decently clean. I wanted to get my revenge before actually running away to heal. It's like, if I don't do it now, they're going to be on my tail coats the whole time. Let's see what we can get done here. We got a lot of marking to do. A lot of marking to do. Check this. Give me some good saves. We're bringing in pretty much kind of the same setup with the gun. Pretty much all the same. Only thing is we put an RP1 in there. And we also obviously are using the ZSH, so we can have a little bit of protection for the head. Granted, I died to a thorax shot, but you know, you, you know how it works. Rubles, a book. Let's keep moving. I actually need to mark one thing right outside of here, actually. Here. I did put on full auto. And the guy that didn't get that much BP, or not BP, PP ammo. He got like, maybe like 60 rounds at the most. I think 60 rounds is probably all he got because I shot most of the ones in my mag and then he didn't really get much out of that one. So, ha ha to him. He didn't get my ammo much. I have pretty much all of it left. Granted, we're below a million rubles now, but it's shoreline. So I kind of expect that. Because this map is horrible. <laughs> Alright, moving on. I'm trying not to complain too much. Alright, this map just This map is the epitome of my life and I hate it. Uh we gotta go mark up the tank. So we need to go over to the left here. We actually we need to mark up three tanks. I need to go backwards. I'm not going backwards, I'm going forwards. I'm sure we're gonna we're gonna be given a lot more tasks to be done here anyway, so I don't think I'm gonna do that. Unless, hmm, actually, unless I decide to take out the shoreline exit, because I do have that available to me at all times, I'm pretty sure. Or not, not sure, the lighthouse. Yeah, Path of the Lighthouse is always open. So I could take that one. That is an option. Uh, I don't see a single scab, though. That's the depressing part. Okay, I have an idea actually what we can do. Because obviously we have to do stuff, we have to go plant a marker down and on the shoreline anyway by the blue building. So the plan will be we'll mark up this tank here, go into a resort, get the items from there. Oh, I do have to get an item out though. I forgot about that. I'm not just planting items. Um That's fine. I can still make it work. But we could kind of backtrack a little bit. So I can place down the markers down at the shoreline and then the one at the weather station and maybe backtrack to the other side, but I don't know. I'll wait. I'll wait because I'm pretty sure I'm going to get more shoreline tasks and shoreline is just going to be my life for today. Hello. Where's your friend go? Where did your friend go? Let's 
I need the half mask. Oh, this changed a little bit. Yeah, this definitely changed a little bit. A little bit fancier in a way. Thank you for missing that first shot. Check what's in your pockets here. Nothing. Your friend was in the bush. Oh gosh, what? Oh, there's two of them. Hello. I'm gonna kill your friend. I don't remember what bush I killed him. Oh, right there. Sir, I need this. Cool. One down. Let's get reloaded here. Let's zoom out of that one. I know I do have variable zoom, obviously. Like, I need to switch my zoom key a little bit. It's a little weird. Like, variable zoom is on here. But I'm so used to doing the clickety-clack thing. I think when we're sniping and like kind of laying down, then I'll look at the variable stuff. I feel like it's obviously not very good for while you're on the move. Well, let's get some stuff here. We got the Westfield 306 key. I did buy this as one thing I, I didn't get a chance to actually talk about, so you started getting immediately shot at. It cost me about 100... No, actually, no, it was, it was less than 100. It was 95,000. Yes, I remember. Because we need that for this quest. Plus, also, I don't think I accepted Nostalgia, so we are definitely coming back to this map. That will give our Docs case, too, which is nice. And that is a Jaeger task as well. How did I accept Nostalgia? It's crazy. Not a huge deal. Not a huge deal. I head up this way. I do need to mark the ambulance, like I said. But, I'm gonna head up here. I do not see you. Where are you? What? He outside the wall? He's outside the wall. I can't see him. very confused there. I was like, where am I getting shot from? I gotta fix my remote now. Son of a gun. Gonna head over to this side. Got a lot of shots still pretty far away. Three oh six. Got a lot quieter. Six. There's the item. Let's see what these guys got on them. Nice. Ooh, I need actually. Hold on. I need that cowboy hat. Cowboy hat. Morphine. In a rig. All right. Well, I don't have any keys, obviously, for for snore line, so I'm going to get out front here and get this marker done. Nearly full, which is good. I was suspect that we could find some kills over at the. Um... Did I see someone? Oh, over at the bus station, so we'll head down to there next after we get this marker done. Okay, we can't believe we got stuck in the box like that. Ah! Don't panic, don't panic. It's not the ambulance we're marking up, we're marking up this. Come on. I hate this quest. That time I can't find the marker. Why is it there? It's so awkward. Like, just make the whole radius in that area just a, a plant. 
please. Right, we gotta head over to bus station, see if I can find some scabs over here. I didn't think it was a player. I thought it was a scab walking. That's stupid of me. I thought it was a scab walking. No, no. Wait, I'm just gonna do night map on Shoreline every time. I can't stand this place. <laughs> it's just, been, it's a thing. It's a thing. Where the heck am I? I don't ever remember this area. Oh boy, oh boy. Let me get to a corner so I can show you guys what we we're bringing in today. Um, or at least for this rain. It's the next day, by the way, for me. I um. Ended up relaxing for the rest of the night. Just because I had some stuff I had to do for the day, so. Yeah, we ended up, um. Do some grocery shopping and all that fun stuff taken care of. You know, the adulting thing. Plus, I also got myself really good, uh. Good chip timing. It was really, really nice. Ended up big old, big old sirloin in for dinner. Mm, delicious. We need to get down to the shoreline. The good thing about this first task with the markings, I don't have to do it all in one. I'm pretty sure when it comes to, I want to say the therapist task, it's either therapist or it's a skier task that we have to come back and like mark all these tables again. Those ones I may have to do it all in one raid without dying, but we shall see. We shall see. But I just want to just get this done with. How dark is it? Yeah, I'd say that's pretty darn dark. Yeah, yeah, night vision definitely required. Let's keep moving. So this is like, oh, I should actually, before I go down to the shore, let me go mark up this tank. Because I was thinking this is actually a very awkward spot. Because I have to kind of, again, th this map, the, the quests suck. Because you have to zigzag so much. I mean, you don't have to, but pro progression wise, I mean, I feel like you, you should, you know? Our plan here is going to be basically we'll go take care of all the quests as much as I can because I still got to go to the resort too. Oh, should I go do that first before going down to the shoreline? I feel like I should. No, 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 no. We're not going to do that. No, no. We'll, 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 we'll mark up the stuff first because that doesn't require, I mean, granted I want to live obviously, but that doesn't require to quote unquote live. It's just I have to get these placed down and it's good to go. So we'll do the markers first. And then we'll head over to the resort and not be a, a dumb dumb this time and literally jump in front of a person. I swear I thought that was a scab. I was like, ooh, another kill. Possibilities are endless. Uh, no, it, it was a player with another player with another AKM. He's like, oh, you just gave me the easiest kill of my life, friend. Which, to be fair, I did. I definitely did. <laughs> There's the tank. There it is in its shining glory. Literally shining from the moonlight. Oh, and it's raining now. Oh, oh. Okay, well. All right. Sure, just turn on the showers, why don't you, Nikita? I'm like, oh, you, you enjoyed having decent vision. <laughs> Psych! So either I have a scab or a player in front of me because I see something moving right over there. You, you may not be able to see it just because of the weather and the... You know, nighttime stuff. But we are possibly coming up behind somebody. Jump over this. Hopefully it's just a scab and then we can get an easy kill for us. Oh, it's, a, it's definitely a scab. Just a scab. That's good. That's good. The best hat and the mask. And I need both of those. Well, yes, I actually do. I need to those helmet, those hats, because there is a quest where you have to get like a bunch of kills with a hat on. I will say, I do enjoy. I do enjoy the. AKM a lot. I mean, the recoil is kind of redonkulous at, at, at times, but I do enjoy it because it is very quiet. Like, it's not very loud. It, it's just like pop, 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 pop. 
Very nice, very nice. Fortunately, I do not have... I mean, I do have the money. We had like 700,000, I think, left in rubles, which I'm not worried about the money. We'll get the money back because, like I said, and, I, and I've said before, this wipe is not hard for money whatsoever. But I didn't want to spend the money on the PPM. It just it costs so much money. So, so much money. SCS, another egg. Very nice. All the money in the world. I almost feel like I want to start saving the eggs because of the fact that I'm gonna to have to buy a lot of those those bastion like plates for the for the head. And it wouldn't be the worst thing in the world. But at the same time, like who knows what the cost is gonna be this wipe. It could be like the cheapest thing in the world. Or it could be the most expensive thing in the world. I don't know at this point. Rockin' SPM or no, that's HPM. HPM. Check the scab in the corner. All right, so that quest is done now. That quest part is done, where we had to drop off all the markers for all the different areas. So that's good. Also, I don't know when I did it. I think this was. Did I talk about this episode? No, it was last episode. I don't know how I got Jaeger to level two. I'm very confused by that. I don't remember doing any Jaeger tasks. I even look back in the footage and I don't, I don't remember seeing any like specific Jaeger tasks that I was doing because I don't, yeah, this is very confusing, but I'll take it. I'm not going to be like, oh no, Jaeger experience, huh? Maybe, maybe the one of the quests I did gave Jaeger experience. I didn't realize it. That, that actually could be the case. Now I think about it. But uh, yeah, I am still saving up the piranha because we are going to be most likely in yeah, like an episode or two, we'll be heading out over or back over to customs to work on the everlasting quest of misery setup, which I don't think it'd be that bad. I've decided though that like I should have technically done the shotgun task while we were killing the 25 scabs, that would have made more sense, but eh, at this point, it's all good. You learn from your mistakes. Sometimes I do that uh, with the with the wipe. Sometimes I don't. I guess it just really depends. So what's the play here? Cause I gotta get up to 306. Which, do I have the key? I do have the key. I can't remember if I had the key on me. That would have been awkward as heck if I didn't have the key. I don't see the sniper scab, so I'm gonna guess they're all dead. Either way, I know I'm coming back to Shoreline, so it's not a giant deal if I don't get all the kills right away. I mean, I would like to get all the kills for Punisher done, like, ASAP, just so that way I can get to the end, because I just I have so many to get. I need to get, you know, an SVDS, multiple ones, so I'm going to need to get kills and players and all that fun stuff. There's a lot of things that are going to have to be done. But when we get some, once we get the Absalon case, I mean, we're basically set. The only difference between the Epsilon and the Gamma is just a single slot. And it's a little bit, it's shaped a little bit different. But I can still basically do all the same thing. The only thing I really can't do is like, hold like one extra thing of ammo. So it's not really a giant deal. Doesn't make or break the situation, that's for sure. So, are we going to have some Scab Brother in the kill here? Uh, not that I can see, at least. Um, oh, yeah, some of the mags do have PP. I should, I should reiterate that. I did say I didn't buy any, but I did have some leftover. So I tossed in the leftover ammo and put it inside the, the magazines to uh, basically start off the raid. And then bought FMJ at the end. I didn't realize PS had so much penetration on it because, like, anything below 40 can go on to the flea market. I didn't realize PS ammo had that much penetration. Kind of crazy. Because I was originally looking for PS ammo versus FMJ, but couldn't do that. Oh, hello, helmet. That was actually a pretty decent box right there. So I'm thinking, I come here, grab the document, and then we head to the village. Do some looting up on the village area, and then we can head out, mark the last tank, and get the heck out of this map. And then come back again. Because, you know this map I gotta I don't remember which part it is but at some point I gotta come back and mark up the the different uh, satellites I don't remember when that actually happens but we do have to do that at some point okay. 
Also, I haven't heard that DMC Karma thing at all yet. I've had people like, tell me like what it's all about. What? But I have yet to hear it myself. Sorry, my mouse was not centered and I lifted it up. <laughs> We're not going to talk about that. Oh, you actually had. I thought I heard somebody. What do you have on you for 129 XP? Is it just the rig? Oh, yeah, PS ammo. Ooh. I'm glad I actually searched you. I left my window open last night which is kind of causing an issue with the mouse and the mouse pad. I don't know if that makes any sense, but it's causing some issues with the movement. Uh, we can load PS ammo now. Get this loaded. I'm glad I'm seeing all these scabs though over here. That's what was going on. I thought I didn't have it on full auto. Huh. Well, whatever. It's doing the job, I suppose. Keep coming, scavers. I need how many, though? I think another five. How many more do I need? Uh, quest, 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 quest. Punisher. Oh, I need four. Nice. Okay. Oh, gosh. How am I going to store that armor? Oh, I didn't even think about that. Still trying to figure out how the heck I'm going to do that. Yeah, we'll figure it out when we get to it. Ooh, you brought me some lunch. Nice. Another ice cream. Shall we indulge? Coil in this gun. No, don't run. I need to kill you. Bruh. Come back, please. Stop running. Oh, my God. I literally turned the corner and was like, hello. I gotta fix that arm up now. I don't think that was him. Pretty sure we have the holes with the eyes, right? I'm gonna take it anyway. On the off chance I don't actually have it. Let's see if you got more PS ammo. You do, good. Actually, let's not do that in front of the doorway. Maybe one more kill. So we're gonna head up and go grab our task item. to the third story up here. Keep an eye out. Now, if you are, you know, one of the amazing people that are, or viewers that enjoy the PvE content, it is coming back. I want to just reiterate that. I'm just trying to get ahead with the series. We're pretty far ahead as it is we're recording. Like right now, when you're watching this episode, like I've already recorded probably like three or four more ahead of time. But I thought I'd just you know, reiterate that. I hear our next victim outside it, I think. Augmented. Let's get this all loaded up. 
yeah just so uh, just a heads up we, we we do plan on bringing the, the pve stuff coming out episodes 12 is actually already recorded and ready to go i just haven't released it obviously but once i feel to the point where we're good to go i will release it of course at this point we're kind of looted up i don't even really need to loot the village just kind of get my objective done and get out of here Loaded. I need to get a different stock on this gun. And, I mean, technically, I should probably get a different set of grip as well, too, so it doesn't jump as much. That would definitely help this gun out. I should probably fix the arm, too, right? Let me fix up the arm quickly. Before I go too far ahead of myself. So, yeah, it it, it will it will get better as far as, like, what you're, what you're viewing and whatnot. Um, for the content you guys enjoy, but yes, um, those things will come back. I just wanted to let you know that. And actually, let's remove this one. And I'm going to put the hose in here. You know, expensive stuff. Okay, did I, I grabbed the document, right? Yes, I did. Now we need to go find a single scab, and then we are good to go with the kills, at least. Which I'm pretty sure I heard one out here. Where did I hear you? I'm not sure, actually. I'm actually just going to go straight outside, and we'll start heading to the next location. But I'll try to get a kill on... One of the other guys. Ooh, I need that actually. I'm gonna put this here. Take the hat. I need one more cowboy hat after that. Bullets everywhere. Or bolt holes everywhere. It was out fights here for sure. Let's go see if we can find that last scab over here. We'll take him out and then we'll go mark up that last tank and we'll get the heck out of this place. Where, where, where am I going to find one though? Either, like I said, it's going to be over here at the checkpoint, or not checkpoint, but the bridge, or it's going to be in the actual village itself. It really just depends on how lucky I get. Actually, I think I see one up there. I can't tell for sure if that's a scab though. Come on, let's go. These scabs guarding the bridge. I do hope so. Anyone home? Oh, I hear you. Definitely a sniper. Oh, do you not count? Oh, you may not actually count. Or was it, or am I one short? I'm um, one short. Okay. You're definitely dead. Check around the corner here, see if there's one side. There was not. Oh, good. Let's get moving. We're going to head to the village and hopefully we find that last scab over there or even on the road hopefully oh god oh god oh god i'm eating thank you thank you you're dead Came out of nowhere. Anti X. Take that. I don't know why I even have it. Um, a melee weapon on me. The only one that I ever would actually care about would be obviously the Red Rebel, which we aren't at that point yet. I mean, technically, if we're talking barter wise, we could do it in a little bit once we get Jaeger up to his next level. Because he is at that point, basically. I, mean, I think it's level 22. I'm pretty sure it's level 3 prep where you get it. 
could be a level four when you think about it, but either way, we got we definitely have it available to us coming up soon. Or I just go hunt down Sturman for the rest of my life and hope that I get lucky with that. <laughs> it's been a long time. And someone commented in the in the in the last couple of videos that I talked about. It actually it may have been like three or four videos ago at this point, but um I got it around like season three or four. I got lucky. So maybe we get lucky again in the future? I don't know. Question mark, question mark. But we gotta get moving. Off we go. I actually do need to get some kills inside the village. I forgot about that marathon task that I want to try out soon. But I need five kills inside the village, which I know where they usually are. They're usually down by like the little shop down there at the end. So we'll definitely take a look at that. I do have that fire task still. I don't think I'm going to do it. It's, yeah, I don't think I'm going to find enough flyers to actually make that worth it. All good, all good. Let's just keep searching. I'm do a little bit of looting through this village since I actually have food in me now. Check this. I was kind of hoping one of those guys was going to have a possible chance of having some type of uh, cowboy head on so I could finish that up. That's all good. Come across this building. Because there are items I can like swap out. That's some money right there. Oh, they mean close that. Whoops. Whoopsies. Metal parts are selling for literally nothing. Like pennies, basically. I guess it's because they're so rarely available. That's why they're not selling for much. But yeah, they sell for like nothing nowadays. Like the highest I've ever seen to get was like 7,000 maybe. Slicker bar. Hollows. Come on, give me something good. That's okay. Actually, those are both good. I can drop this, drop that. Drop that. And we can take this, swap those over. Actually, I can just drop the cash because I'm sure I'm going to find something a little more valuable than 2,000 rubles. Like this amazing key. That, oh, so never mind. Someone's gone through the village already. I was about to say, this amazing key I'm about to find in this back area here. Ooh, I think I just saw a scab. Yes, I did. We got some stuff. I heard you, but I don't see you. Where'd you go? Suka. Somebody talked over here. Was he inside the building? Well, that's three so far. That well, that well enough could have been him. Where's the other mask I needed? Wash well, to see if it's more PS ammo. Oh, FMJ. Never mind. Oh, cowboy hat. Oh, no. That's not cowboy hat. <laughs> Never mind. Like that. Condensed mill. Uh, wire's like pretty expensive. Shush, I can kind of change up a little bit. I only need two more, so that's good enough there. magazines oh there's cowboy hat uh, I will actually I know I've got that one I know I do so I'm gonna drop that 
I'm gonna drop this mag. Don't want holding that still. Couple of hits. Okay, we gotta go. I've done enough looting. I need to get this thing marked up and get moving. Very good. Very good. And now for the hopefully not deadly part, the exit. Oh, stressful, stressful. But you never know if someone's going to be camping it. But I, think we'll, I think we'll be fine. I think we'll be fine. Oh, that's right. You can literally exit over here. Oh, I love the fact that they changed so much of that like that. Oh, and I didn't accept nostalgia again, by the way. Who would have guessed? Cast turn in. I love this part. Let's turn in Punisher part one. Turn in this guy here. That's going to give me another task rigged and samples actually unlocked. Very nice. We got all seven of those. Now I need to eliminate scabs while using a suppressed weapon on reserve. Fun. Fun times. I also need to go and locate all the different entrances on reserve too. So not the worst task actually. The rig game comes back up. I need to, and I get a markers, which is initially nice. And then we get 12, 13,000 XP basically. So we gotta do literally the whole thing again. <laughs> the fun part, we'll do it again at night. I'm gonna be honest with you, nighttime's just gonna be my thing. We got a mule stem, nice. P22. L1. Oh, they're all the same, okay. So nothing's changed. Interesting. Okay. I thought that maybe they would change. Nice. Eagle eye. You gotta go and collect the crash site items. Easy enough. So, oh wait, no solar's still locked. I'm sorry. Level 28. I was like, I saw it come a lot like available, but it's not actually available. Weird, but sure. Okay. We'll go with it. Got yeah, locate, locate, locate. Three out of the five kills on that one. Very nice, very nice. Okay, let's get this stuff dropped off. So I need to kind of wiggle some items around. I'm gonna leave more room here, but our course of the game. Okay, toss this here, toss this here. Drop all these items off, make my money. And I decided not to hold on the eggs. Just make money, <laughs> make money. That's all I'm thinking about, make that money. Even the hoses I'm gonna sell for right now. I mean, actually no, uh, no, 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 no. I remembered I need to hold on to two of them. There is a task coming up soon for Peacekeeper, so I need to make sure I hold on to those. Drop all these things off. Boom, 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 boom. Actually, no. <laughs> I'm back here. I need that. Where's that? Where's it at? Where's it at? Ooh, I lost it. Oh, there it is. Vaseline. Vaseline. Got my CMS kit as well. Bomber can go, but I'm saving this for later. And I think I can honestly sell his key back. Yeah. We'll just go, oh shoot, we'll be far down. We'll go like, I'm gonna give him a discount, 90,000, because I used it twice. That seems like a fair deal. I think it's a fair deal indeed. Yeah, it was, see, someone's like, you know what, that's fair, mate. You decided to use it a few times, but um, not complaining, thank you. 66,000 on the Keki Kek tape. What else we got? We got our, oh, scope, oh, 77,000, that'll work. What else we got? I've got med tools, which can go for 24,000. This is where I get my money back. The money that I've been missing. What else I got? Wires. Oh. 19,000. Pretty nice. We're selling everything instantly. That's my favorite. Granted, it's early wipe, so kind of expected. Let's go 45,000, because there's like a pretty big gap. So I'll go right in between that gap. And what else can I sell? I think that may be a net. I think the rest I gotta sell to traders, yeah. To the traders. I'm gonna prep over here. I'm gonna get a little bit more money spent with you, even though you're technically good at the moment. Who do I not have good money with right now? You, sir, can take this axe. And my axe. Actually, this can sell for a decent amount. Oh, that's a big gap. Let's go 40,000. We'll sit right in the middle of that gap. That's kind of weird. I don't still think this will sell for crazy. No, it won't. 
15,000. Okay, it's literally a pennies difference, but I can sell it to you and get a little bit of money towards that. Save this, obviously. I'll sell the Sailor to you. And then therapist, enjoy all the good items. Yes, it's, give me my money. Mechanic, actually Ragman, sell those off to you. And Peacekeeper, you can take all these special guys. Actually, do I have a... I do, okay, I've still got it. I'm good, I'm good, I can sell these. I had to make sure I had the SSD. Because uh, it is needed for a quest later on. And if I didn't have that, that would've been kinda eh, awkward. Well, I don't have those. Car repair, I need to turn this in. I'm now a six out of eight. And I also need a battery still. I think that was it. That's a, pretty much about it. Oh, wait, nope. Mechanic, sir, I need to turn in another one. Another But I also need to find those those CPUs. How have I not found CPUs at all? It's kind of crazy. Kind of crazy I haven't found those yet. I also want to go to Lighthouse. <laughs> I really want to go to Lighthouse, but at the same time, I need to just stay on focus. Because right now, as far as task goes... Oh, shoot, I have another task. Uh, therapist. I forgot health. Pharmacy. Part 2. Part 3, which is locate the van on woods. Oh, we get morphine unlocked for this too. Oh, that's level four though, loyalty. Never mind, got a while for that one. All good, all good. But I gotta go to woods in a little while anyway. We have so many tasks, so many. Let me go back, take a look at my task list here. What do I have now for shoreline? Eagle Eye and rig game. I think that today is just gonna be a shoreline day. I need to just focus on getting as much as I possibly can. Peacekeeper, I will take my rewards, please. What about therapist here? Ooh, that's a very good reward. Forgot about that reward. Ragman, I'll take all the goodies from you. I don't think there's any other ones, was there? Yes, there was skier. My markers that I was talking about two seconds ago. Crap or I did a task for you. That's right, I got this armor. Ooh, where am I gonna put all this stuff? I really need to start looking into the upgrade on the stash, which we will do. I'm going to spend a whole day just making money, and that's how we'll do it. But, man, got to start making that soon. Got the ammo at least, and I can put that away. I'm sure we'll use a vow at some point. And my money. I'll come back for the other stuff for now. I don't have a lot of room to work with. Not a lot of room at all, but I need to get some food. Let me grab some food here. I think I still have a single syringe left to get this or I'm completely out. Oh no, I still have a syringe. Now I'm completely out. <laughs> I was like, okay, close. I know one of them is almost out. Keep this up. Drink a little bit of this up. And yes, I am going to do it at nighttime again. Just so you're aware. This is definitely a nighttime day. A nighttime day indeed. I got my mags. So did I lose a mag? I think I lost a mag. Buy one more of those. I threw away my uh, my ammo, so I need to go get some more of that because obviously 42 rounds is not going to last me long enough in this in this game. Uh, splints, splint. I'll take the three out of five, just to use it up. Very good, very good. Alrighty, alrighty, alrighty. Uh, I can switch this out too. I don't really need this AK anymore. Actually, yes. So we'll save this for later. Oh, I I bought a bag for no reason just because I realized I don't actually need this. We're bringing back out the Uzi. Uzi. So let me get some ammo bought here for that too. Where's my ammo? Oh, actually, no, I should be finding ammo. I think. Let's take a look. Load it, load it, load it, load it, load it. Yeah, we're fine. Boom, boom. Obviously, I don't really have a lot of room to work with it down here, but I could do this. I'm going to do that, actually. So that way I don't lose out on all my ammo. That's kind of expensive. This was not cheap at all. And it's more expensive than CMS. But that should be good. Let's get this one reloaded. That was good, but we need to load this one too. Go over to Jaeger. Buy my ammo. You guys like to see this stuff, so I try to show it when I can. So I'm definitely showing you guys what I'm buying. And... That should be good. A little bit of a repair. Off to oh. do, 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 do. off back to shoreline. All right, let's do this. Actually, we got a really good spawn for this. Yeah, this is a very good spawn. 
need to head up to this location here because this is going to have like the first spot that I need. Actually, I think it's right in front of us there. We got to grab the SAS drive from the fallen drone. And then after we do that one, we need to go and head over just across the bridge. That would be the other one. I do have the rig game one. I think I'm going to wait for that, actually. I was going to originally do it, but like... I really don't feel like zigzagging into this place, but we'll see. I mean, it all depends on what I get, because I do want to loot this place up here. The one that's right to our right here. I'm going to check that out in just a second, but I need to get this drone all taken care of first. Pretty dark at night, so we should be decent with the cover. I try not to give away too much of my position. Just stay close, do our thing, and we'll be just fine. Originally, while we were waiting for this to become nighttime, because I probably had like a good like 20, 30 minutes before it actually was going to be turning nighttime, I tried to get ready to film for episode, what was it, episode 12? Yeah, episode 12. And um, I was like, ooh, yeah, I could go do this real quick and like focus up, getting some stuff for like a scab run. Yeah, that didn't work out. I just, I, I loaded in and then immediately the game crashed. So I was like, well, okay, never mind, never mind. I'm always trying to plan ahead to stay ahead where I can, where I can start filming. But uh, it just didn't work out today. It didn't work out. What do we got? We got PSO. I feel like most people, actually, it's very dark in here. I was going to say maybe I could turn out the night vision, but not really. Uh, most people probably heading to like the resort and whatnot, so I should be okay for the most part to loot this area. But I'm going to obviously stay vigilant and listen out for them, just in case. I want to get my money back up. I'm obviously going to be able to get money no matter what. Especially when we get like level 3 unlocked for... For prep war. Not for prep war. I'm sorry. Peacekeeper. Oh, that shot's far away. Okay. Once we get Peacekeeper to level 3 and we unlock some, some better ammo. That will actually start becoming very beneficial to us. Because then... Oh! Hi. I found him. Partisan. Hello. I thought he was inside with me. Huh. Oh, a little bit of a loud day, don't you think? <laughs> uh, where are we going? Oh, that's right, this way. Unfortunately, I had to bring out the AK again. But, I mean, I could have bought some other stuff, but I am trying to save a little bit of money that we got. Let's do this. And hopefully it goes a little bit better than last time. I think since we are here, I'm going to go drop off the markers first. Like all the locations and then then we'll go collect the SAS drives. I think that would be the best plan here. I'm going to check the safes too. Once we're right here. Open. Was definitely hoping to fight Partisan in a different way, but... Honestly, like, the audio was so messed up. I, I mean, maybe you guys could tell a little bit easier when you were watching, but for me, it sounded like he was inside the building. So, like, I put all my focus, like, behind me, and then I saw his head pop up. I'm like, yeah, this is going to go either a good way or horrible in a second. And my notion when I said earlier, when I said PS rounds are not available on the flea market, I must have been typing in the, the wrong thing. Because, uh, no, they're definitely available on the market. Like, there's a ton of them. So, that's my bad. I completely mis misread the information on that one. So, hopefully that is understandable on that one. And back out to the rain. I think this one I have to hold down the marker. Quite certain. Come on. I hate this... Come on. There we go. It's only 15 seconds, but still. We can get this place down, then we can head down to the shoreline next. Come on. Actually, no, I think this one's okay with the markers. Like, with placing them down. I, I believe it's the therapist one when, they make, when she makes you go to all these locations. Then you have to, like, visit them all and survive them all. I'm quite certain that's which one it is. Been a while since I've done this, so <laughs> forgive me if I don't have all the information correct on that one. We need to head 
all the way down the shore. He wasn't that quiet, by the way. Like, yeah, I, I didn't notice him there at first, but like, after he started shooting, like, he was pretty loud about where he was. But hey, we'll get him next time. We will definitely get him in the next time. I'm sure he'll show up at some point. Holy crap, I didn't notice him until literally as I was running into him. Oh! Alright. Thank God he was climbing right there. I would have died. I don't see anything else. Come on. What'd you find? You got something. Oh, okay, I'll take that. Okay. Oh, PST was using. Oh, he must have killed somebody. Yeah, he killed somebody. Nice. All right. Won't say no to extra items for nighttime. Plus, that's two less people I got to worry about now, which is good. Get to the shore over here. Make sure no one's actually planning that and walking past them. It wasn't too bad there. Take him out. I, I do need to... I think when we get in the bush over here, I'm going to load this mag, though. Gotta make sure I'm always ready to go. Still gaining stamina, which is good. I wish I would have brought 5,000 with me, because we could have taken the vehicle extract out. That's on me. I should have I should have done that. Dang it. Why didn't I think about that ahead of time? Plus, I didn't collect the cash that was behind us at the, the safe, so... For the next time. For the next time, I remember to do that. Hopefully. <laughs> we'll see. Let's get this loaded up. And then maybe he hasn't checked these safes. So we can check these too. Good. Armor's not that messed up either. I mean, he's level 16, so he had access to AP 6-3, but luckily he didn't use it. This one placed down. It's very loud with this rain. Almost there. Good. Oh, that was that's the chair up there. I was like trying to figure out what that was at first. See what we got inside the safe. We got a skull. Doesn't seem like this was ransacked, so we should be good. Come on, give me a flash drive. I, I know I'm gonna do that peacekeeper marathon task anyway, but if you could have it for me, that'd be great. I'm gonna take that food too. Take that with us. No CPUs yet. Definitely next um, next episode, I'm going to do some scab runs to hopefully find some CPUs because I am just not getting luck. Okay, best way to do this, uh, honestly, just run straight up to it. Get it done as soon as possible. I, I'm glad I took this route, though, versus the other way because then I can let people do their fighting and whatnot over at the resort. And by the time I get there, then I can pretty much have access to everything I need there. I think maybe I go across the... Oh. I found the SVD, man. Ah. I thought he was straight behind us, but he was across the way. And I, I couldn't spot him. Yeah. That's so unfortunate. That's unfortunate as heck. 
Go ahead and spot him. Well, the good thing is, like I said, this one does hold, so it's not a huge deal. We just gotta go mark the one over at the health resort and we will be completely fine. But yeah, just unfortunate dying like that. I, I tried to locate the dude, I just could not find him. I was just like, where? You're where now? Where? So, <laughs> it's what it is, it is what it is. This one seems very complicated. Hand over found raid car med kits. Then find in a sale of the law. I got the sale of the law. The cat tourniquets. Okay. I feel like that's gonna be a frustrating one trying to do it. Nostalgia is not unlocked. Lock. Stop saying it's unlocked. It's not unlocked. You lied. And that's a wood task there. So, all good. We have to come back next episode, obviously, and get some stuff done. Um, yeah. We're gonna hold on. How many was it? How many was this? Three of them, so I only need one more. This one's gonna go on for a decent while, eight hours. So I sh maybe I'll take a look while we're while we're walking around the map, see what I can find. But just could be a one that we could just do while we're walking around. But most likely next episode we'll do a day run, and hopefully we can get lucky in finding everything. Need. I'm gonna have to build a weapon, uh, go through all my items, and see what I can use. Cause obviously I'm dying. It's not the best thing in the world, but. We'll see what we can make happen. I want to get those shoreline tasks done and continue on. Obviously, reserve is going to happen next episode because I need to get suppressed kills on the on the, uh, the scabs so I can keep working on Mr. Punisher here. So we will definitely get there. It's going to take a little bit of time. So if you guys enjoyed today's episode of the Rad Riches series, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below what you enjoyed about the episode. What you're excited about for the future. If you haven't yet, make sure that you subscribe, ding the notification bell, and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you.